Hello everybody, Ragtag Sagvi here, welcome to the next episode! In the last episode, we defeated Hop in, a, Hop, in a, Hop in an amazing rival battle. And now, we need to go find his brother Leon with the aid of Pierce and Team Yell. Let's go do that. After all, we deserve our dinner! I thought this was automatic when we came out here. Okay. Man, why am I here for this? I'm totally exhausted from the battle with Do with you, Donnie. We decided that Team Yell will cheer you on, Donnie. Let's let's help out together. What a beautiful display of sibling love. However, it's entirely unnecessary. Miss Olivia! Chairman Rose is with, ch with the champion in a very, very important meeting. There's no way A, I will let at anyone interfere. After all, only authorized personnel with the proper keycard can ride the monorail to Rose Tower. That means as long as Chairman Rose is in the tower, no one can disturb him. I have selected a member of the League staff and given them um, a key. Chairman Rose does enjoy these kind of mental games after all. Do you think you could tell the difference between a normal League staff and the one I chose? Do you think you can find me? What should we do? Tch. This isn't good, but I got this one. Donnie, Team Yell, I was yelling, will handle this. No, this is brilliant. I'll search around the front of the stadium. For now, we should try and head to the plaza together, right? Alright. Let's all work together and head for Rose Tower. Let's find Olivia's League staff member. The bad one was wearing those lame shades, right? More than that, he had his jacket open so we could see his shirt. It's finally time for the Champion Cup. Being super busy makes you want to slack off, doesn't it? If I were this bad uh, league staff member, I would just lose the sunglasses. There are some league staff that have gone and started up a fan club dedicated to Miss Olivia. Let's take a look around. He should be somewhere around. All right, nobody over here. Got a team grunt yelling uh, running around the fountain talking to me ain't gonna help you find the bad guy now is it I'll cheer you on so go out there and track him down I heard that the champion and chairman Rose are having a very important discussion right now I wonder what it's all about we're crazy busy because of the championship cup and yet I can't get to Rose Tower some league staff aren't doing their jobs. I want to get to Rose Tower, but the monorail isn't moving. So there are some good league staff members, and there are this bad league staff member. The only difference is that the bad one is wearing sunglasses. Why even bother with a different look then? Hey Donnie! This bloke's awfully shifty, but I can't get him to turn around. Say something surprises so you have no choice but to look this way. Alright, you already said that. Miss Olivia's here! What? Blast! I turned around! And I can't escape! In that case, time for a Pokemon battle! That was my macro cost is to Edward. 
Gonna start with a Galarian Meow. Let's see, let's give it a good old sniping. Take the shot. <laughs> Down goes his Meowth. Ooh, Kodo's close to level. I didn't even notice. Let's bring out Durant. Actually, I'll bring out Arsenic because four times weakness. Being Bug and Steel. My cheers really get, get it, getting you going. Thanks for the help. Arsenic is now speedy because of Team Yell's cheers. Lash that bug. Go to reach level 64. Don't suddenly talk to me like that. I accidentally turned around. All I need to do is hide. I won't have to give you the key. It's a wonder how fast the guy could run. I got no idea where he went, Gov. We saw him run off in this direction. Uh, he hasn't already gone. No, he's over here. Because there was no League staff member here. How did you find me? Or did you just talk to everyone you met? Bah, whatever. I'll defeat you this time. Let's battle him again. Gonna start with a Marwile. Let's lash this Marwile. Marwile has fainted. Arsenic Root level 64. Bring out extra drill. Let's bring in 41. Feel that flow. Yeah, you're feeling it, Donnie. Let's go. Defense's special defense went up. Let's just take you out with one shot. Forty one reached level sixty four, and Yoshi reached level sixty six. And I even switched up my Pokemon while I was running! They say hide in a tree! Hide a tree in a forest! So I thought I could hide myself in the crowd! And he runs away yet again! Raiden, you take point, cause uh, Ars- Cause uh, Artisan isn't gonna be having fun with this set of with these set of battles coming up! And he's decided to go and hide himself in a telephone booth. I don't know if he was trying to Superman his way out of this. You're way too a servant. But this time, I'll make my getaway. Gonna bring out Pharaoh Seed.
How do you like four times damage, Sparrow Seed, being steals of grass? About to bring out Steelix. Ooh. Okay, let's get uh, Raiden out of there. Bring in 41. Yeah, have some of my support. I know you can keep the beat going. You're the best, Marlene. Special attack, just what I need for 41. Snipe that metal snake. Power we need to take it down in one shot. Hiding didn't work and battles didn't work. The only thing to do now is run! Seems like you got me cornered. But I'm not giving up. An earful for Miss Olivia is way worse than anything you, you lot can do. Good luck catching me on the monorail! Team Yell. Go O-Fine oh, Hop. We'll corner the League staff member at the station together. You did a cracking job cornering that bad League staff member, Donnie. Let me sing you a song fitting of your rockin' deeds. The only thing humble a singer can do is sing a humble song. Maybe I can't cheer someone on just with the tunes I play. Maybe my songs don't make anyone happy. Maybe I can't help it. But still, the only thing I can do is sing. Sing my humble song. Piers! Go Piers! Hey, isn't that Piers? What is he? Why is he doing a street performance? I think you mean a station performance. Come on, let's see if we can get it closer. Dan Siggy's dance to the beat. <laughs> We got the key, Pierce! Yes, we can take the model El Rose Tower now! Ow. Or is that Marlene that's speaking? I can't tell. There's no name of oh, over that. Donnie, hop! Now's your chance! Go! Get out of here! So this is Rose Tower. Just how tall do you think this is? I can't even see the top up up there in the clouds. So what should we do? Team Yell is going to have their hands full holding up those bag league staff members. They won't be catching up anytime soon. Yeah, Donnie, what should we do? Let's go on ahead. Good thinking. Let's go collect Lee and get out of here. Without him, there's no champion for you to challenge in the Champion Cup. Donnie, you cleared the way to Rose Tower. Now all you gotta do is charge on ahead. An employee... An, an, an employee is an employee, I guess. Seems that exact lady... That exact lady hid the monorail key. To try and impress the chairman. 
Chairman Rose has been keeping the champion holed up inside. Wonder what he's plotting. Times like this, when I, when tension and passion runs high, reminds me of Spike Smith in the old days. Some right wild concerts we had back then, but no encores. Wait, you're still here? You better get going. I'll send some proper support your way with a yell. Gotta stick around to make sure my bro oh, doesn't do anything too crazy, right? Come back if you need anything. Let's go, Donnie. I love that bow that Pierce gives. Uh, this was like, what was it, the 16th to 19th century? How, being nostalgic would be a disease. And I'm not joking, that was an actual thing around that time period. People thought nostalgia was a disease. Rather than, you know, people appreciating the old things. Look it up, it is not a joke. Get a, a cell battery. Uh, do you say anything, Hop? Wait, is there something up behind the sign? I forget if the Yes! Get... Irai Impulse. Let's go, Donnie. Let's go raid the tower. Uh, yeah, I'll keep right in the lead. Whoa, it's huge in here! What in the world is this place meant to be? <coughs> Listen, Donnie. Don't know if you knew this already, but I heard Rose Tower is built out on a power spot. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. When we get to the at, at, up to the roof, if we'll have a bit of space, we can Dynamax our Pokemon. Which, which is all well and good, but a, but a less certain... Erton, this is what, uh, whatever this lift can get us to the top. Rose Tower is, has like a hundred floors, right? You'll be leaving right now. There's no need to worry about the lift. Intruder alert. Intruder alert. All staff are ordered to help remove intruders from the premises at once. See? If Miss Olivia says so, then it looks like this is the end of the line for you kids. If I get rid of the intruders, I'll probably get a big bonus. So we have to battle our way through the microcosmos. Sorry, with Eli? Is that how you say his name? Eli? Eliha? Gonna bring out Durant. We'll just burn this ant away. Having to give up on buy pocket money. Losing means I'm back in the red. My, my bonus. My dream of finally affording a house of my own. We need to speak with Chairman Rose. Tell us where he is. Get on the lift. The chairman's at the top of the building. All right. We're nearly to the Chairman Rose. Hold on, Lee. We're coming. Come on, Donnie. Let's crack on. I love how she's calm during all this. Welcome. This is the front desk of Four Rose Tower. She is perfectly fine with us, you know, raiding the facility. This is taking ages. What? I don't think we're at the roof yet. Why have we stopped? You two are the gym challengers, aren't you? Thanks for taking part in the Galar League gym challenge. Yet I'm afraid that doesn't give you the right to interfere in our work. 
We will drive you out to protect the many subsidiary companies housed in Rose Tower. Behold the glorious high-tech elevators of Rose Tower, able to withstand Pokemon battles. They are constructed by a subsidiary of Microcosmos Construction. Double battle time! Time for us and Hop ho to team up to face Microcosmos, Jane and Matto. I love the little finger waggle they do before they throw their Pokemon out. Alright, uh, Cutie Font is probably the bigger threat here. Because so I know it's Steel, I forget if it's part Ground type, but I know it has access to a lot of Ground type moves. Which is bad for Raiden, so I'm going to take out Cutie Font first. Yes, squish that bell. Don't forget to ring that bell and utterly squish it. Let's burn away bronze on. If it has heat proof, then this is going to do less damage. Um, I don't know if it has heat proof because I think heat proof would have activated if it did. Right and reach level 64. We've created an extraordinary lifts that at safe or even for Pokemon battles. No one can beat Marco Cosmos construction when it comes to our dedication to our work. I love it even when you beat them, they're they're still advertising their companies like, yeah! We lost to intruders, but Let's still advertise! If I've been defeated, I have little choice but to respectfully retreat. Yet I must ask once more that you please do not interfere with Chairman Rose's work. The elevators of Rose Tower are constructed so only the floor ascends. But the pre but the presence so uh, but that presents some danger. Just the presence of these walls constructed of light. You can thank Microcosmos Construction for providing this wonderful technology as well. Wait, so the folks working in the tower can stop the elevator from the outside at any time? We're just trying to get to the top already. Our teams have been working themselves rugged for us. Let me heal them all up. So you don't get to switch your Pokemon around between fights, but Hop does heal you between fights. To make up for it. I don't know if he's chatting with us or if he's uh, jamming out. Rose Tower is almost a thousand feet tall. You are now about 500 feet above the of the ground. I am from MC Insurance. Do you have an insure? Do you have a life insurance policy? Is that supposed to be a threat? Like I don't get that line of dialogue. It's like, do you have a life insurance policy? Is that supposed to be him threatening me, or is he legitimately asking, wanting to try and set me up for life insurance? Given what's going on, I can't tell if he's being legitimate, like advertising it, or if he's just trying to say it in a threatening manner. Let's burn away the Maw while. Nice! Way to go, Raiden! Arson reached level 64! Let's squish these gears! They're shifting! That is a pretty cool animation, not gonna lie. Now it's much faster. Let's melt away these gears. 
But not as fast as Raiden. Defeat Kevin and Carla. No one can beat MC Insurance when it comes to our dedication to our work. This building is well over 500 feet tall. And that is as tall as around 100 machokes standing on top of each other. I'm quite terrified of heights actually. Unfortunately, our insurance doesn't pay out for being defeated in Pokemon battles. Time to go up. And we've stopped again. You're nearly to the top, but you're not, uh, but you will not be meeting the chairman. I've got no fear of heights. I work high in the skies during my job for the lovely microcosmos air. Challenged by Avrian and Justin. Ooh, bring out a Steelix and a Stun and a Stunfist. Want to get Raiden out of here? Uh, let's bring in Koto for this. A squish that giant metal snake. Flatten it. Oh, this is ain't gonna be good for Kodo. Ouch! <coughs> Didn't realize that muddy water. Kodo, unleash an earthquake on these two. And also kill Double in the process. I thought Double would be able to survive that. Critical hit on the stun fist, so that's guaranteed its defeat. Muxie! Felix is influencing a curse! Terminate. I don't have to worry about you getting hurt by Earthquake. Let's give one more Earthquake to finish off this Steelix. Shake the building down! Yoshi reached level 67. No one can beat Microcosmos Air when it comes to our dedication to our work. You ever get that lofty feeling when the lift is going up? Don't you press Don't you presume to meet the chairman? You're not on the same aim level as such a great man. You must know that in high rises such as this one, the higher you go up, the more important the people you find working there. Chairman Rose is at the top of the top, not just of this tower, but all of Galar. <laughs> looks like we made it, made it, looks like as though, oh, we're nearly there, mate. Look sharp, let's do this.
Well, we've reached the top, but we have one more obstacle in our way. And we'll handle it in the next episode. So if you enjoyed this episode, do you like the videos? It helps tremendously. Subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment down below on your thoughts on this episode. And share the video so that more people can discover my content and help, and help the channel grow. And I'll see you all next time. Later.